Hey everyone, how y'all doing? Well, I got my kayak shed um, going here and I got the roof on. Um, I, got a, I got a bargain on the, uh, on the, uh, the, the tin roof. Um, it, you know, it's really good other than the fact that it's got some, def uh, it's really heavy gauged and got a nice coating on it. And looks, it's the color of our green of our house. Um, so, uh, I had to modify, um, it some of the way. Um, so <laughs> I got them messed up, but I, I, I had some, uh, Latter-day Saint missionaries. They saw me like working on this thing. Um, I think it was Sunday or Saturday and they came and they, uh, they go, Hey, you want me to dig the hole? You want me to help you dig those holes? These two kids. And they did. And so some of the holes got kind of, <laughs> kind of cut off and didn't really line up. I mean, I was like, I was just glad for their help. So we had to like make do. And so I got kind of a little cover here. That's catawankus and some of the stuff's off centered, but some of it's okay. And so I had to like really <laughs> do some screwed up dimensions and, uh, but, uh, here, here it is so far here. Here's the roof, right? And, uh, you know, so it's going to be like, it's 12 foot deep and it's, uh, it's, uh, um, so I had to make, I, I put these here, this set, I reset the recess this back because, um, it had to be 12 feet. And although the, this, these were over a little over 12 feet, uh, I didn't know which one I was getting. And, um, I got the, those for 10, 10 bucks a sheet. And normally they're 60 bucks. See, and, and see like right here, like the, this pole <laughs> was, was offset <laughs> into the center. Um, and really, I think that these two poles were lined up or all these are lined up. It's just this one, when I put this one in the ground, I had to dig a huge rock out of there. And, you know, and when I was setting this pole, I, I didn't even think about it. And I set it in there and uh, I didn't set it in there plumb with all of those back there. So the dimensions of my shed are a little off and we can make it work, man. Um, yeah, and a lot more stuff's going to go in here. It's going to be, it's big, man. So my garage is going to get emptied out. And all my, and all my, uh, uh, um, kayaks, gardening tools, wheelbarrows, it's going to go in here. Um, some of, some, like I think in this portion over here in the far, like near the wall, I'm going to put like a little splash guard and kind of make a little decking there. And maybe for my, uh, like, uh, like weed, weed eaters and stuff. Um, but it's going to be cool. I mean, look, look, so, I mean, look how, look how big that thing is. It's, it, it, it's, it's, uh, it, it, you know, a couple things, you know, those kids came to help me and then a lot of times, see, like this, the, these, this, those two poles in the back are plumb, but this one's off here in the front. So, uh, you know, I just kind of messed up. But anyhow, um, it would have been better if I could have do could have done this uh, without uh, making any mistakes. But I did. Everything cemented in the ground, and it'll be fine. I mean. It's just going to be a nice dry place and once you put a fence around it like let me show you what the intentions were <clears throat> so 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 as you can see these pickets go up above the wall right or above the roof so you won't even be able to see the roof from the street, right? I mean, we can raise them up a little bit, right? So, so, so that that was the purpose of doing things like this, because you know, with HOAs, um, 
you can't really have a shed on the side of your house because they don't want to see a shed from the side from the street so just hide the shed behind this you know lower the, the shed the roof of the shed and hide it behind because this is dead space right here that this serves me no purpose other than uh you know i mean you can't really put a picnic table here i mean it's just not a really pretty place uh I mean, kids could play over here, a little game or something, but we don't have any kids. I'll, I like storage. Empty my garage out. Put I I'll, like I'll, I'll, putting a little home gym in there is what I want to do um, in my garage. So, I mean, because, you know, I don't know if I, I even want to go back to the gym. Get my wife out there working out with me. See, now, this got pretty straight right here. Um see now the, the now these so so i this wasn't really level so i kind of screwed that out and that looks really good now i mean i'm not a carpenter okay so so anyhow yeah this is what this is all right so tell me what you think comment below like subscribe do all that other stuff the kayak shed tool shed big one 12 by 16.